right, this is requested by Kenny. So he's launching PC games in the PC games wheel, I assume. And he's manually having to close both rocket launcher and PC games. Well, there's a reason for that, Kenny. So if we hop to our PC games, well, let's hop to our PC games. Whenever you configure a title, you can do it very easily. And with PC Launcher, you can just define an EXE file, and that's it. However, once, let's just say Donkey Me, I, I go to, once I select Donkey Me, I'm going to go to Modules, PC Launcher, Edit Global Module Set. Oh, sorry. I'm going to go to Edit System Specific Module Settings. And we're going to take a look in here. And I do believe, oh, no. Let's just find the title. It's in here somewhere. Let's just do Dragon, Double Dragon Neon. So you do have an exit method. If you take a look right here, exit method. When close application, Pathway EXE. These right here basically are your ex exit methods. Now, once you define any additional perimeter, you're gonna have to set a fade screen your fade title, which I defined in the active, I mean, in the previous video. You can simply uh, launch the EXE, and to launch the EXE, you just define one, one EXE value. Let me do, let's go to our PC games. Oh yeah. There we go. All right, so let's just take a look. These are additional PC values here. So, I'm just defining one EXE file. However, if I define an exit value, and so I'm telling the exit, whenever I click this escape, close the application. Now to do that, you're going to have to define the app weight exe. Basically, that's saying hook this exe and make sure this is always running. If not, then go ahead and start the rocket launcher rocket launcher shutdown. To do that, you also have to configure your fade title. Now, what these two values here will allow you to do, actually these three values here will allow you to do, is capture the window title to make sure that it's always running. That way, when it's not running, Mr. Rocket Launcher knows, okay, it's no longer running, let's shut everything down and return you back to the front end. It looks for this EXE to be in memory. So these two values are very important. And it, it's not very fun capturing the fade windows, but um, if you want to exit just by hitting the escape key, which honestly for PC games, I would not recommend. If you just want to launch a game, exit it and return back to the front end, make your values look like that. That's it. Otherwise, you're gonna to have to set these values right here. Um, that may be a little confusing for you. Um, probably not, but maybe. Um, so for example, let's just go Double Dragon Neon. I'm going to go to Modules. So I need to set an app weight EXE. I would click this and define this Double Dragon EXE. Actually, you can take, you can do this. Um, now I just messed up my, um, PC launcher, uh, and I'm gonna have to restore. Then you're gonna have to capture your fade title and do exactly what it says here on the screen. I'm gonna hit cancel because I don't want to capture the fade title. And then your exit method. So if you just want to hit escape, close, go back, you can do win close application, um, process close application. Process close at EXE is what you're waiting on here. So I hope that helps. I know it's a little all over the place, but it's probably the easiest way I know how to explain it.